Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. You know, tonight is one of those nights where you just, I don't know, run to Shinatri's, grab some ingredients and just make chili. I mean, that, that's just the type of weather we're having uh, right now. Well, yeah, I mean, not, not a, I guess the rain makes it feel chilly, but I've talked about the actual food, too, which now I'm hungry. Anyway, we uh, are dealing with uh, rain, and uh, we're going to be uh, dealing with this right through uh, the overnight hour. Uh, temperature now in the upper 40s. It's calm wind. Uh, we have pockets of steadier rain falling out there. Numbers now, like I said, upper 40s to right around 50, so pretty uniform in terms of temperatures. Uh, down to Otsego County, Edmiston, hanging near 50, down to Morris. Uh, Mid-40s, upper 40s, Cooperstown, mid-40s as you make your way towards Old Forge and up into the uh, Adirondacks where it's raining up there too. We were just talking about mud season. Uh, this isn't helping, right? Uh, check it out. We got uh, rain steady at times. We go in nice and close here. So this is near Marcy, uh, the Route 12 corridor downtown, out towards Westmo and the throughway, uh, out towards uh, Turning Stone, some pockets of steadier rain stretching into Herkimer County. So that's Little Falls, Route 169 up to Fairfield, uh, Route 29A, uh, some steadier rain falling there near and just north of Herkimer and then down into uh, Otsego County as well. Uh, we've got some steady rain uh, for everyone tonight. So uh, yeah, it's just not nice. Low pressure, uh, you know, I was talking with uh, my intern uh, tonight uh, who's fascinated, come here, come up here. She, she, she is a bright young student, come on in here, that is learning about meteorology. She's very embarrassed that, hi there, this is Angela. And she's going to be going to college for meteorology uh, here in the fall. We wish you the best of luck. But we were just talking, hey, if this were snow, yeah, this would be a pretty plowable snow, right? Yeah. yeah. So best of luck to her. Uh, I hope I'm helping teach you something oh, yeah. about weather. All right. Off you go. Thank you, Angela. She's a big help. Low pressure. Uh, that is working its way up the coast. And then we uh, look ahead to the day tomorrow. So. There's all your wet weather tonight. Uh, it will slowly start to taper off through the day, to, actually by the pre-dawn hours, but here's the deal. When you wake up tomorrow morning, it's still going to be kind of gray, and there's going to be some patchy fog, some drizzle. But by the afternoon, as uh, drier air comes in, I expect uh, more sunshine developing. Uh, temperatures by the afternoon with a northerly component to the wind very similar to where they are today, so like low 50s, but Friday should be a beautiful day with a lot of sunshine. It will turn milder by the afternoon. Additional rain on top of what you already may have in your rain bucket uh, will average from about a quarter inch to maybe uh, a, a half an inch uh, as we go through the rest of the evening and uh, into the uh, overnight. So it's rainy, uh, fog, mist, drizzle. You know what else is going to happen? The night crawlers are going to come out. You'll see them all over the pavement. It's disgusting, but it's that type of weather. Temperatures will be near 40 tonight, and then through the day tomorrow, again, sky-wise, it will be kind of gray and low clouds in the morning. Gradual clearing by the afternoon, breezy, cool temperature within a couple degrees of 50. Friday's beautiful, a Heinz 57. Uh, with a good deal of sunshine, and the weekend's not nice with rain developing in the afternoon. And there's that little taste of winter. As we spring forward Saturday night, we kind of spring back into winter. With rain to snow on Sunday, uh, regular snow, and then some lake effect snow too on Monday. It could be some small accumulation, only in the 30s, windy, cold, but some nice weather returning by uh, mid next week. I thought it was just right here to have our meteorologist on one side. Future meteorologist. She's going to do great. On the other. Smart cookie, man. She's teaching me some things. <laughs> well, Craig, I, I do have to ask. Um, you mentioned it's chili weather. Uh -huh. What do you put in your chili? Oh, everything spicy. I'm a spicy. Really? Yeah, I love it. I'm on the other side. The spicier. How about you? I don't like chili. Uh, oh, <laughs> I don't know if you could hear that. Angela said she does not like chili. We're going to have to talk. Yeah, that's going to be a problem for sure. <laughs> it's right. good to have you. Yeah, thanks to uh, both of you guys. Still ahead on Eyewitness News, the state SUNY system has a plan to do away with plastics on campus. We'll tell you how and why coming up next.